Item number SCP ES 297. Object class Keda. Special containment procedures. Creative and preventative responses to SCP ES 297 have largely failed. The Foundation's current efforts are coordinated towards observing infection patterns in case an exploitable weakness manifests itself. Standard procedures for the Broken Masquerade class scenarios created by the SCP ES 297 pandemic is to anesthetize and evacuate civilians from the area. Site 19 update Site 34 maintains an electronic record of all SCP ES 297 1 locations, updating as necessary when an SCP ES 297 1 is created. Description SCP ES 297 is an infectious phenomenon that affects architecture inhabited or otherwise used by humans. Infections typically start in restaurants, cafes, and other food establishments, hereafter referred to as SCP ES 297 1, before spreading to the venue's cash register, which will display messages saying thank you for choosing Taco Bell. The infected locations menu will expand to include items typical of SCP ES 2972 establishments, such as tacos, burritos, etc. Over the course of 8 to 13 months, the location of SCP ES 2971 will undergo a self contained structural reorganization to resemble in appearance a standard. SCP ES 2972 location. SCP ES 2972 is a concept of the Taco Bell fast food restaurant chain. History The first host of SCP ES 297 as a pizza restaurant in Downey, California, which lies. Update Lysis is a breakdown of a cell membrane, often by viral, enzymatic, or osmotic mechanisms that compromise its integrity. In one SCP ES 297-2 instance, on the 5th of March 1963, as the incident was originally believed to be a single unexplained event that took place over months, no amnestics were administered. The restaurant was allowed to reopen because the owners and employees had lost all memory of the previous restaurant's existence and believed that SCP ES 2972 had been open since the beginning of the year. SCP ES 297 continued to increase in virulence and host numbers undetected until 1967 when 10 locally owned restaurants were simultaneously infected, closing and reopening as SCP ES 2972 instances in a similar time frame. Early curative efforts consisted of exploiting pre-existing bureaucratic channels to prevent the spread of SCP ES 297 and potentially sterilizing already infected sites. Treatment efforts included, among other things, lawsuits, rigged health inspections, and ingredient recalls. None of these were effective. Competing restaurant chains, Kadaba, Chipotle, and Moe's Southwest Grill were funded by foundation front companies to compete with SCP ES 297, but this strategy became unreliable due to constant mutations of SCP ES 297-2 in the form of sales and special events. Below is a table of dates and notable mutations and events regarding SCP ES 297. Addendum 1 A bridge register of notable SCP ES 297 instances. Downey, California, previous settlement. Unknown, local pizza restaurant. March 5th, 1963. The first recorded infection of SCP ES 297. Downey, California. Previous settlement. Multiple restaurants. July 13th, 1963. Discovery of the infectious properties of SCP ES 297. All restaurants in Downey, California were affected. 
Austin, Texas. Previous settlement, Burger King, fast food chain, April 7th, 1972. First active attempt to stop the spread of SCP-ES-2971. Containment attempt, the Foundation's resources were tactically deployed in the local court system to encourage closure following the introduction of rats and mold spores through the roof ventilation. Despite overwhelming evidence, no closure was made. Further investigation revealed that employees of the local U.S. FDA office had repeatedly visited the facility over the past six months. Albuquerque, New Mexico Previous Settlement Chile's First New Mexico Bank March 4th, 1986 First Manifestation of Cross Construction Three instances manifested side by side over the course of two months, progressively disintegrated the walls separating each structure until all three hosts merged into one SCP-ES-2972 instance. Hoover, Alabama Previous Settlement Water and Co. Auto Repair Shop Car Repair Workshop October 10th, 1992 First SCPES 2971 instance completely not associated with food. Mexico City, Mexico. Previous settlement. Carlos and Charlie's restaurant. June 4th, 1993. The Mexican government by chance became aware of SCPES 297 and attempted to force the chain to close. This invariably caused all government officials to be unable to perceive SCPES 297. Furthermore, all existing SCPES 297 documents in Mexico were deleted. It is worth mentioning that SCPES 297 has shown an increase in infection rates in the country since this event. Irving, California. Previous settlements. Multiple businesses. February 2nd, 1994. Rapid conversion of a corporate building into an SCPES 2971 instance. The individuals affected by SCPES 297 at this location claim to represent Taco Bell at various executive levels, with one individual claiming the title of CEO. Following this conversion, the Foundation investigated all individuals claiming to be high-level officials of the corporation. All of the subjects concerned were former employees of the various companies that rented office space in the building, and there was little or no suspected anonymous activity or prior involvement with SCPES 297 Continued Location Register 3 Portlands Previous Settlement Rockers Rock and Rocky Road, Ice Cream Parlor, November 18th, 1998. First SCPES 297-1 instance appearing in an anomalous community. Containment attempt. The Foundation's resources attempted to coerce the FBI UIU to force the closure of the instance, which was rejected. Further investigation noted several SCPES 2972 instances located in the vicinity of the UIU headquarters in Washington, D.C. It is unclear to what extent SCPES 297 has affected groups of interest. Munich, Germany. Previous settlement. Spicy Crust Pizzeria, Foundation's Front Company. May 8, 2000. First Foundation Front Company that has been compromised. Containment attempt. Foundation agents deployed to incinerate the facility. Despite their success, the instance was rebuilt over the next six months and resumed operations. July 26, 2003. The Ambrose Restaurant's GOI ceased activity. All establishments have been transformed into SCPES. 297-2 instances. Paris, France. April 1st, 2006. The city of Paris is lost. All buildings are now SCPES 297-2 instances. Containment attempt. Complete quarantine of the city of Paris established. Deemed a failure 
after a new SCPES 297-1 instance discovered one kilometer away in the city of Fossile. A broken masquerade scenario was declared through internal foundation channels and a media statement was prepared. Beep. Previous Settlement, Site 19. January 26, 2007. Site 19 becomes an SCPES 297-1 instance and all staff are lost. SCPES 297 file has been updated. Combo number 297. Object class delicious. Only $5.99. Special seasoning preparations. To prepare a beefy crunchy taco supreme, first retrieve a crunchy taco shell from the top reservoir and place it on the line rack. Next, use the blue handled spoon to scoop a single portion of seasoned beef from your container. Once done, move your taco to the seasoning station. At the seasoning station, the taco will first be coated with a single shot of the sour cream gun. Next, add a pinch of three fingers of delicious iceberg lettuce, as shown in the onboard video. Now, add a pinch of two fingers of grated cheese and diced tomatoes each, as demonstrated. Once done, move it to the wrap station where the taco will be carefully folded into a single wax paper wrapper, folded in a three-step motion as demonstrated in the onboard video. And just like that, it's done! Nutritional data! Serving size, one combo, three tacos, 327.4 grams, quantity per serving, calories, 570, Fat calories, 290. Total fat, 32 grams. 49% daily value. Saturated fat, 13 grams. 65% daily value. Trans fat, 1 gram. Cholesterol, 85 milligrams. 28% daily value. Sodium, 1,010 milligrams. 42% daily value. Total carbohydrates, 46 grams, 15% daily value. Dietary fiber, 10 grams, 40% daily value. Sugars, 5 grams. Protein, protein, 24 grams. Vitamin A, 35% daily value. Vitamin C, 15% daily value. Calcium, 25% daily value. Iron, 15% daily value. Allergenic information, milk, soy, gluten, egg, fish, seafood, walnuts, peanuts, wheat, GMS. Ingredients, seasoned beef, beef, water, seasonings, cellulose, chili, metrotrextrin, salt, oats, soy lecithine, spices, Tomato powder, sugar, onion powder, citric acid, natural flavors, including smoke flavor. Tabula yeast, cocoa, disodium alucinate and gluconate. Dextrose, lactic acid, modified cornstarch. Salt, sodium phosphates, contains soy, reduced fat sour cream, milk, cream, modified cornstarch, lactic acid, maltodextrin, citric acid, sodium phosphate, natural flavor, cellulose gel potassium sorbate, cellulose gum, gall gum, locust bean gum, carrageenan, vitamin A, veins milk, certified vegetarian, iceberg lettuce, fresh iceberg lettuce, certified vegetarian, taco shells, ground corn, vegetable oil, soybean, corn, and or corn seed, oak fiber, certified vegetarian, tomatoes, fresh tomatoes, certified vegetarian, cheese, fresh tomatoes, certified vegetarian, cheese, fresh tomatoes, certified vegetarian, certified vegetarian, 
Cheddar cheese, cheddar cheese, coated pressurized milk, salt, enzymes, annatto, VZ, anti-kicking agent, contains milk, certified vegetarian. Special offer. Are you a Taco Bell fan? For a limited time only, you can win this hoodie. Details here.